Hi loves, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Veronica and I film very girly content. And if you're not new here, um, hi, it's been a while. Um, I can explain. So <laughs> basically, where have I been? Um, all over the place because <laughs> uh, I don't wanna make this intro too long, but I feel like I have so much to tell you guys. And basically to sum it all up, uh, we were moving. So that explains the new setup a little bit. Uh, we were moving. Uh, <laughs> and then in the process of us moving, I realized that I was pregnant. So I am literally six months pregnant right now. So that was another thing that kind of was like, oh, wow. <laughs> so I was just going through a lot, you know, with the move and with finding out that I'm pregnant. Because not to get into like too many details, but like we had just had like our son. So it was not planned, but that's okay, you know baby's a blessing and yeah so there was that then what else happened oh my god there was so much last time i talked to you guys was like december and it's literally june and yeah i just i feel so bad because like i was always like oh my god i want to film i want to film and it's like I, you know like i wanted to make content for you guys but you know just life got so busy and i was like you know don't put that pressure on yourself like when it's time you'll be able to sit down and make content but i feel like i'm still rushing because the sun is setting and you know you want like good lighting for videos so <laughs> i'm trying not to ramble but yeah also uh, my hair is red because in the midst of all this i decided that i wanted to try every hair color known to man so i literally like from december to now i have had pink hair purple hair um blonde hair of course because i bleached it and mind you i bleached it like before i found out i was pregnant so yeah but whatever that's besides the point so now i am kind of like a dark burgundy red and everyone keeps like saying like oh you're in your aerial phase and i'm like oh, oh yeah i guess because like the movie just came out and everything so i'm like yeah, yeah yeah that was totally intentional yeah um but yeah so i don't i'm see i'm rambling but yeah I hope you guys enjoy this video. It's probably going to be two parts because if I have enough sunlight or daylight left, um, I do want to show you guys what I got at Michael's. That is so cute. I went to Michael's and I literally fell in love with everything that's there. So I went crazy, but of course I am an idiot and it is June, so it's summertime and I am in love with their spring collection and... I just want to get that video out to you guys because if you're like me and you didn't realize how cute the spring collection was everything's like on super clearance right now so like you have to like run and like hope that like everything that you want is in stock because a lot of stuff is already like out of stock for like i guess the rest of the year but yeah that's besides the point hopefully i can get to show you guys we're just gonna jump right in with ross and marshall's and all our favorite stores and yeah side note side note but very important side note my style i feel like is has evolved literally from like december to now into like full-blown like shabby chic like just french provincial like i just like the coquette vibes it's just it's speaking to me and it has always like spoken to me like i've always loved thrifting and vintage and pink and shabby chic things but I don't know i just feel like i was fighting it for so long i really wanted to like join like the kawaii and like the super pink like and don't get me wrong i love pink i literally i love pink but i feel like i am leaning a lot more towards shabby chic and i've always wanted to and i feel like now i'm just kind of like let's do it girl like what do you have to lose like just go for it because i just love it it makes me so happy like all these cute little shabby chic items that i found like a lot of this stuff you'll kind of get the vibe from it it's not so much like kawaii pink like you get me it's more of like hmm, little vintage little <laughs> little shabby chic moment you know so yeah that's just where i'm at right now in my life and i'm sorry if this intro is very long so let's just jump right in but starting off strong literally i don't even know if this is within the frame like i don't know if you can see all of this but I got this little stool, like little vanity stool, and it was $35, and it is this gorgeous light baby blue, and this is what I'm saying. I love all the pink, I love the girly vibes, but I feel like baby blue, 
could also be girly vibes. You get me? Like, it just screams, like, a little shabby chic color. And I, I don't know. It just, I love this color. And I wanted something that didn't take up a lot of space. So this was a good alternative for, like, a big vanity chair, you know? But I am on the lookout, like, on Facebook Market for, like, a cute little vintage vanity chair and all that. I'm just, I am in full-blown, like, vintage, shabby chic vibes. And, yeah, okay. So we're starting with Ross because I got a lot of stuff at Ross. And, yeah, I have no idea where to start. Let's grab stuff. Let's, let's show you the damage that I did. <laughs> so, okay, whatever. I'm not going to mess with that. So, one of the first items and one of my favorite items that I found was this hanging jewelry organizer. And this was $9.99. And this was just for like the little like makeup travel bags and stuff and it is just so cute and it's giving like that little vintage shabby chic vibe that i've been i can't stop talking about so yeah just like the bow the cute little pattern it has like this sticker here that i'm gonna have to like fix that but it's okay it's okay we'll make it work but yeah it's double-sided and i am very excited to organize my jewelry with this because it's also gonna look like really cute for like pictures and yeah so jumping into the next bag oh my god these are so cute okay so i got these little pajama um marie uh pajama pants and this one was 10.99 and they are so soft and they are so fluffy and i just i can't wait to wear these because it's just all the cozy vibes and cute and pink we love it the next item that I got was this little picture frame and again it's just very cute and shabby chic and it kind of like matches the vibe of this pink one that, that I have back here but what I'm thinking of doing is just like printing out like some Love Shack Fancy like they have like wallpaper prints that, like basically just like their prints from Love Shack Fancy like their patterns I want to print them and put them in here and maybe just have like a little bow or something just dress it up but yeah that's my that's my idea with this the next item is for my daughter and i'm so jealous because i was like i literally want this but our windows aren't set up like that so her windows are like super cute very princessy and look at what i found oh my god this is this is so gorgeous for 9.99 it is like a three-piece set and it's like just like one of those like decorative like I don't know if you can see that but it has like the draping at like the top I'm screaming I want to go put this up right now in her room I'm working on like her little like room makeover because it's it's very girly okay um it's very girly uh surprise surprise and a lot of the stuff that was actually in like my pink glam room I kind of just moved into her room because she loves all the girly things just like mom so i really want to do like a pink girly girl room tour of her room yeah i don't know why that was so hard to say um but yeah because my baby girl is turning four and i am again on the hunt on facebook market for like a princessy like twin bed like bed frame and all that so her little cute girly room princess room tour it's coming soon it's coming soon so moving on and speaking of my little princess I literally have this whole like <laughs> this whole basket is full of girly things and some of it is for her some of it's for mama but for her I got these little satin kids hangers and again like I have so many ideas for her room I want to make like like a dress up section for her like a princess dress up section because she has like a frozen dress a Rapunzel dress she has all that so I thought these would be cute to kind of like put her dress up dresses on yeah and this didn't have a price on it um but they just rang it up for like $4.99 so I was like that was good to me girl I'm just gonna finish up the stuff that I have for her so I also got her these cute little look at these biker shorts they are sparkly i don't know if they're picking up on camera but these were 7.99 and they just 
they're gray and pinks and I want these for me I want these in my size then for for $6.99 I got her these cute little shorts because it is summertime so I got her these shorts and the florals the butterfly and before I forget the actual basket it just says my stuff and I don't know I'll probably just like turn it on like an empty side where it doesn't have like any other wording but this one was $7.99 like this basket and I was like that's pretty good it's, pretty, it's a it's a nice size basket so I was like yeah yeah she has a lot of toys so then this is kind of for her kind of for me kind of for both of us <laughs> so I got this little backpack it's like a little mini backpack it is so cute it was $18.99 so a little a little more expensive um but it was $18.99 and what got me was like this little like bling part here like quilted bling thing it just it I was like that is very cute and it has a cute little like daisy or flower pattern on it and I say it's for her for me because if she wants it she can have it like it's basically for her but I do plan on like wearing it like as my purse if we like go out because these little mini backpacks are so like they're so practical to me I feel like they're so practical because they fit diapers they fit wipes they fit snacks they fit my wallet they fit my perfume like they they just fit everything you know and like yeah I can have like a shoulder purse but it's like I'm a mom like I need my hands free and I'm pregnant I need my hands free you know so little mini backpacks are just yeah and since I can't afford like the $150 love shack fancy one because that's the one that's that's the one I'm dreaming of that bag kind of rude I am dreaming of that that bag I think it's like the Darla bag or some backpack <sighs> I'm dreaming of it but yeah so I was like you know what this is pink and it's, it's got a little bling and a little sparkle and some flowers I was like it's 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 a vibe it, it fits the vibe so got this and it's one of my this is one of my favorite purchases for sure so that's everything for my daughter for the most part then moving on to mama's stuff okay 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 i was shook i was like pixie what are you doing here like i know like they're they have like a lot more brands now i guess at ross like um like even like impressions vanity and stuff is starting to appear at ross so i'm like okay ross but yeah this is so so cute because the skincare mama needs it um and it's summer so and it's so look at how cute this is okay anyways so this was $7.99 and it has the cleanse the tone and the moisturize what else do you need what what else do you and it's travel size and it's cute. girl like somebody put this down because this was like by the like furniture section and like I was like oh why would you put that down but thank you <laughs> next item that I got are these little press-on nails and these were $3.99 and they're just like this Tiffany mint blue oh it's just it's speaking to my soul right now like I just I love it I love it I love it and my nails are <laughs> let's ignore my nails you know because mama didn't have time to get them done so maybe in my next video I will have these and I think it's so cute how it comes with like a little nail polish so you can like paint your toes to like match. Like, how cute! Then the next item. Oh, goodness gracious. Okay. I literally, oh my god. I just, I found so many cute things. Like, like just comment down below if you agree. Because it's literally like I'm freaking out. I'm like, oh my god. I found so many cute things. And like, I don't know. You know, like. And you tell your husband or your boyfriend or whatever and they're like yeah, yeah it's nice yeah babe it's like they don't understand like look at this these are like little hair clips they were four dollars four seventy nine and they're little like bows like can you tell they're like bows girl they're bows 
I want to wear it right now. I want to wear all of this right now. Then the, uh, not the last item, the next item. The next item I got was $12.99 and <laughs> I know I just said like backpacks are more functional for me and they are. Um, but this is just too cute. But maybe like a little date night, you know, like, like how cute this is. It's so tiny. Like it, it's even for like decor or something, you know, like even just to decorate with, this is so cute. So got that. It's like the perfect pink. Like I love when it's like not like a muted pink, but like a soft pink. You know what I mean. I know you know what I mean. A little more to the shabby chic vintage style. So this was $6.99 and these are just like little hand soaps and more for like decor purposes, I would say like functional use. I don't know, they do smell great. Like they smell amazing. They are made in Italy. <laughs> Cute. Um. <laughs> But yeah, they're made in Italy. They're just rose scented little hand soaps. And I thought the box was beautiful. I bought a lot of like shabby chic stuff for like my bathroom. So I thought this would be really cute as like decor and maybe just propping like one of the hand soaps on the side somewhere. It's just so cute. It's so cute. It's so cute. They smell good. They smell like roses. They smell, they smell like the vintage vibe. Girl, what is the vintage vibe? Okay, anyways. Then, along that theme, this was $9.99. Little expensive, but, I mean, yeah. $10 for a teacup, mm, yeah. But it's really cute, and it's really simple, and that's what I liked about it, that it was really simple. So I could kind of just accessorize with it. Because, girl, I don't even drink tea. I don't even drink tea. It's just, but look how cute it is. I don't even have space to put it anywhere. Okay. And then the last item in this basket was $3.99 and it says, this is embarrassing because I just told you that I don't drink tea, but this one says that's the tea. <laughs> so, um, yeah, what will I fill this with? Um, perhaps a hot cocoa because that's, girl, I drink water and juice if I'm being honest with you. That's all I drink. So let's move on to Marshall. The first item I got was on clearance we love a clearance fine and it was for five dollars and fifty cents and it's one of those like hair curling sleeping sleep with the hair you know what i'm talking about i know you know heatless curl scrunchie so i thought the bag was really cute too honestly i'm probably gonna use this bag in like my purse and stuff you see like you can put like you can put some diapers in this bag and then throw it in like your mini backpack and put... i'm gonna do that I'm... one of my next videos is gonna be like what's in my purse slash backpack mini backpack that's coming up then i got okay then i got some makeup brushes so these are from the revolution beauty london brand this one was 3.99 and Honestly, I got these because I just wanted like some nicer brushes that were like pink and rose gold. So yeah, that's why I got them. I got that one and then I got the highlighting, the like the fan brush one. This one was also $3.99. Then, ooh, the last one I got, I was really excited for. Um, this one was $5.99, but it's a foundation brush and it's like it like came out of the package or whatever like the box is kind of like beat up because somebody like spilled like foundation on it and I was like oh that's kind of rude but it was like the last foundation brush and I use a beauty blender and everyone says like foundation brushes are like really good so this is me trying a foundation brush and accepting the fact that the last one was in a beat up box but then the last item from Marshall's are these little Morphe uh, lashes, like these little Morphe lashes, and this was $3.99, so, and these are in the style, go on and fake it, because <laughs> we need some, we need some help with these eyelashes, I didn't even put on eyelashes today, <laughs> okay, maybe the next video, and then, moving on to Dee Dee's, I know this bag says Ross, um, I can explain, I don't know what happened to my Dee Dee's bag, <laughs> 
like i tried to like you know because they give you like 30 bags when you go to a store so and then i have like all these bags like by my vanity so i was like oh my god there's too many bags and i guess i just i was like organizing and like minimizing how many bags i had and i guess i threw out the dds one so this one is in a ross bag but this is all stuff from dds so and i don't have a dds near me so like i like rarely ever go to dds but what i did find was really cute so these are like little anklets i think yeah bracelet or no they say anklets yeah and this was $6.99 and look how adorable these are because you know it's summer so we need some we need some cute little accessories everywhere I'm like how cute I love the pearl ones the pearl and the flower ones are just so cute so can't wait to wear that then I got some more hair clips because I I can't have enough hair clips so these were $7.99 and I just like the colors. I like how they were like neutrals. The little pink one. Then I got some more makeup brushes. Um, I got these because they were cute, honestly. And these were $9.99. They're just pink and rose gold. And I just wanted all like all of the pink and rose gold brushes, I guess. And then the last item I got, which is like, girl, you're like, you're about to be in your third trimester. What you buying heels for? <laughs> but I bought them. Anyways, so these were $9.99 and they're just little baby heels in my defense. These are, these are like little, little small heels, but they're cute and classy, kind of trendy with a little square toe detail. But for $10, I was like, no. I'll get those. I'll wear them eventually. And then the last bag is from TJ Maxx. And I didn't really get a lot here. Oh, okay. So the first item I got is this little is this little like Minnie Mouse bag. And I got this mainly for my daughter. I don't know if I'm gonna put this like in the diaper bag, but it's cute. And this was Never mind. Why does it say it was $15 for this? I paid $15 for this. <laughs> I thought it was like $7.99. It is cute. Even though if I had to tell myself, girl, don't pay $15 for that. But it's the creme shop. So and it's pink. It's cute. I got that. Look, this is where all my lashes are. I got more lashes. So I got some Ardell lashes. And this one was $3.99. And this one was $5.99. So very cute. Very cute. So no wonder. I was like, I don't know where my lashes are. Like everything's still kind of like I'm trying to figure everything out. Because like I said, I moved. And all my stuff is all over the place. You know, so. And then the last two items from TJ are from the brand Kapari. And I got this shower oil vitamin c shower oil for $12.99 because i heard that it's better to shave with like a shower oil with like oil than like shaving cream you know what i'm saying and yeah i love their packaging like i love how pink and girly it is and then the other item i got was $8.99 and it's just like this glow cleanser so yeah i got that and let me see. Ah, it's so cute. It's a really good size too for like $8.99. Pretty good. So yeah, so that was everything from Ross, Marshalls, TJ Maxx, Dee Dee's. And to be completely honest with you, I still have the stuff from Michael's. <laughs> and that is probably going to be in the next video because I really want to do like the haul and decorate with me of that stuff so you guys can kind of see like my room and kind of what I did with it and just get to experience me shifting into that shabby chic style you know so yeah that is everything that I got I hope you guys enjoyed stay tuned for the next video I might still be in the same outfit so don't judge me but yeah 
I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know down below what was your favorite find. What are you feeling as far as like the shabby chic style? Do you dig it? Do you not dig it? Like, yeah. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.